Mrs. Tina. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. Not sure if this is working well. I don't know where the thingy is on my phone. Anyway, a new setup. We're testing something again. I'm very good at that. Uh, yeah, today is the monthly haul. And boy, what a haul we have! We have a lot today. Um, because two weeks in February, no, two days, two days in February, uh, about nine came to my house, and just as many okay, maybe more went to my partner's house, like a whole bundle of money. It's just like chocolate. And they should have came like over a period of like two, three months. And they came over a period of two days. Other little bundles came in too, but who cares about those? They're just itty bitty babies compared to the big mamas that came in. Anyway, <clears throat> we're gonna have fun showing them all off and hopefully line it all in the image. Also, this is like my first day off in a while, well, second day now, like two days in like three weeks, whew, I am a tired one. Anyway, uh, I've mostly been blogging anyway, so let's begin, I think I'll put this in the wrong way. First we'll begin with the hardcover stuff, so things like Full Metal Alchemist Volume 16, oh uh, sorry if the light's terrible, I'm going to figure this out yeah, as we go along. Isn't it pretty? So pretty. Oh, yeah, I should start like here and be like, look, you can see all the prettiness. And then I realize that's terrible, so we're gonna figure this out as we go along. Uh, oh. That looks slightly better. Yeah, I'm using the selfie mode. That's why everything's flipped. Flip flopped. For now. That is, anyway. Uh, it's also so I can look at the screen. Don't looking! <laughs> that was stupid. Anyway, next is volume 15. This is a pretty. And then. Yeah, do it like this. I'm actually enjoying this series because I'm finally nearing the end after many years of wanting to collect it, never getting there, never getting there, never getting there, and now I'm finally getting there. Uh, they currently influence other things I haven't read yet. Um, also, I may be sharing some titles I haven't quite read yet. So that's fun. Also, I've been going back to blogging, so that's also fun. Oh, I'm going to write about this one soon. Um, so we're going to probably not put it back just yet, but anyway, next one is Junji Ito's Deserter. Um, out of like 12 stories in this, uh, let's see. Uh, there you go. Uh, pointless to do this, but there you go. That's all the content, and I only like maybe four of them. With the actual title name being one of the good ones. I didn't enjoy it as much as I have the other series. Actually, in the recent ones, I haven't been enjoying them at all. I do look forward to the Black Paradox being printed. Because I think that's one that I actually enjoyed and I'm glad it's actually coming into print. I wouldn't mind all the stuff about Suichi and all that. Considering, like, the, there's, like, parts of the anime about him. There's, like, two pops dedicated to him. And yet, we don't have the manga yet. That's really depressing. I do, do, do hope Biz gets around to that. Got good high hopes for them because they're a good company. Uh, the next one is My Other House Husband. Kitty edition. Mm -hmm. I've read this one too. Um, because I'm going to write a small blog about like Deserter. I might as well add in like Vampire Night Memories and My Other House Husband. Because... With Wet House Husband, it feels like it's getting boring. 
it's still enjoyable, but it's like the same thing over and over. There's like nothing really going on now because it feels so rehashed. But I guess that's just me and I wanted something more and I didn't get it. Anywho, next we have Hell's Paradise Volume 12. We are now one away from the end. It is looking pretty. Uh, I have written a blog about this one as well. I actually enjoyed it. There are some parts in it that was really enjoyable. There you go, I'm spoiling it all for you. Do you hate me now? Oh, look, big spoiler. Yeah. I'm terrible. Tell your friends. Um, the next one is uh, end of a series from our sweeties at Kadansha. You're thinking, oh, now you're calling Kadansha sweeties. There's a reason. You'll find out later. Sweeted Soap has finally reached its climax. I originally was not going to put a post about this, like do a blog about it, but I ended up doing it anyway. And uh, I kind of complained in it a bit, but I kind of didn't at the same time. It's one of those things that I would like, but at the same time it's like, it's so good. Yeah, I'm very confused. Okay, let's spoil this one too with... There you go. Spoil, but there you go. Here you go. Did you catch that? Oops. Should have left that on one. <laughs> uh, but we have no idea what was going on anyway. The next one is... Living Room at Tsunaga Sun. Eight and nine. Put it on my chubby arm. Here we go. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, I recently going to order nine, uh, ten, 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 ten's coming soon, well, ish, whenever it gets released, and then after that, once it hits eleven, that one's gone too, I look forward to it, because I enjoyed it, and now I'm bored of it, <laughs> that sounds so bad, um, anyway, another one I was excited to see finally come out, Magus of the Library, volume five, I'm enjoying this, I like where this is heading, I wish I could do a review on it, but I enjoyed it too much, and I had zero motivation to review it. Yes, my reviews are based on motivation levels. I mean, I had some motivation for some, but not for the others. Uh, you're my foots. Uh, anyway, let's go on to the next pile. There are so many piles here. Whoops. Nearly gave that away. Anyway, next one is... Volume 10 of My Boyfriend in Orange from Tokyo Pop. I don't mind if someone else prints this one day. Or can Ancho finally get to pull their finger out their bum and print it? That would be nice. Um, next, I did write a review about this one. This one's from the English Tokyo Pop, um, Alice in Bishonen Land. I went in expecting not this. Let's just say not this. I like the fun play on like how games like this games like this that's presented in this manga it was really enjoyable that part but i'm wondering how this is going to end well when basically then next volume i think um there you go the part i'll show you is look there's some color it's so pretty there you go say hello to other bishies that she uses yeah Mm, I expected better. It is not a great manga. It's good if you like things like that, but it is also okay. <laughs> um, yeah, the next five on my lap I haven't read yet because I am not ready to read them yet because I am going through a pile. So let's have fun with these ones. First up we have is Persona 5, Volume 8. I look forward to reading this because it's got my favourite girl on the cover. Yeah, I love Futaba. She's so cute. I'm going to spoil this one. Oh, no, I cannot look. Ah, ah, I'm destroying it for myself. Eh, not really. I played the video game. I kind of know what happens. Um, next two is Jujutsu Kaisen 13 and 14. Yeah. 
Okay, cool. I haven't read either of those, so I can't comment too much further than they have nice covers. Yeah. Um, the other one is Demon Slayer. Stories of Water and Flame. I haven't read this either because I am terrible. I don't know why I looked over at my Nezuko figures. I'm thinking, they're so cute. And then of course we got the newest manga from Biz. It is Deadpool Samurai. I look forward to reading this. Um, yeah. It's further down in my pile so it's not going to be read for a while. I have a feeling I might review this. Um, then again, it's also like really, really short. Here we go. Next one is the shoujo aspect. <laughs> the shoujo aspect. The shoujo side of his media. First up, we have Yano the Dawn 33 and 34. This is not one of the longest series I have. It is like middle ground too long. Because I got things like Skip Beat that really, really pushes long length. Uh, yes, I also have not read those yet. They're further down in my file. I have read this though, from Find Out Memories. Um, I like the flow better of the story, but that's about it. <laughs> Nothing else. I don't know what else to say. Though, I have to admit, this is starting to get more interesting. Snow Out with the Red Hair Volume 17. It's starting to get good. Starting to enjoy that. Uh, I might actually put that in the review as more of a positive story. Well, the two others are not that. And then I might add this in too, because look, more Queen's quality, 13. Um, as you can see, I'm currently reading it. I nearly finished, I think. Let's see. Yep, nearly finished. We shall find out more about that later. For me, not you guys. Sorry about that. Um, anyway, we got Love Me, Love Me Not. I think uh, the next one after Queen's quality was going to be Jujutsu Kaisen's, and then this. So we get to finally finish this. Yes, I love seeing that. That is my favourite thing in the world. Because it means one less series to worry about. One less shoulder beat to caramel. And then we got King's Beast, Volume 5. Look at that. It's so beautiful. So pretty. Still so so far down in my part because I haven't read it yet. Next one. More things I haven't read except for maybe one of them. <laughs> yes, I'm that terrible. Uh, let's start with the condenser titles with Vampire Geometry. This is one series I'm in the middle of ground about. It's not bad, but I don't know how I really feel about it yet. Um, next is the series why I like Kinetra uh, at the moment. Love to Kelly 1 and 2. They finally got their print. They both finally came in this month. Like a day apart from each other. I haven't read it, but my partner started reading it and that made me really excited. Let's see if I can push these down. Choo -choo. There we go. Because we've still got like two more piles after this. <laughs> Uh, this one I have read, uh, Toilet Bound and Uncle Ken. Um, I am indifferent about the series now. I'm not enjoying it as much as I used to. Let's just say that. It started off interesting and then that recent arc just bore the shit out of me. But anyway, not my problem anymore. Uh, another one I decided to try and re-read, uh, re-buy to see if it's like a parody or a kino or whatnot. And that's Love of Kill. Look, I finally got two and three. I've progressed. But from Kino, because why not? <laughs> Better spot good old Kino. If I don't, that's on me. And then we got Golden Japanesque. I missed originally pre ordering this, so another Kino buy, as you can see. That's the same thing that happened with Toilet Bound Hanako. I haven't read that just as much as I haven't read this, but I have read the light novel completely, so. I do know what's going on here. I love it. It is such a cute series. I'm really enjoying that one. Next, we're up to the small mangas before we go on to the light novels. I've read most of these except for two. Starting with one I haven't quite read yet. Uh, yeah, yeah, we'll start from there. I only got this in recently and that's Secret Sight. You will see this title again in shortly. 
because that's how I roll. Uh, next one is my next offensive villain is Sidestar. I've been doing this. This is so terrible. I love it. I need more of it. It ends in two more volumes there. Ooh, I really, really, really love this series so much. I really wish I got the name droid of Katrina, but that's all me. Next is the final volume of Girl Girl. Uh, it was okay. There you go. Have some pages. I enjoyed where that was. I, uh, I enjoyed the series. I just didn't quite enjoy the ending. It was. It was interesting. I have thoughts about it, but um, I think I wrote a blog about it. Not too sure. Got to double check that one. If I didn't, I should. Anyway, the next one is The Dragon Knight's Beloved. I haven't read it yet. Uh, this was a pain in the ass to get, so I had to get it from Kino. I had to wait till it came in stock before I can get it from Kino, and it came like a month after it released date. Uh, delays will kill me one day, possibly. The next one is The Apothecary Diaries. The one I ordered like months ago and it finally came in. I'm enjoying this series. I definitely wrote a blog about this because it's one of my favorite series. But look how pretty it is. So, see, so pretty. It's beautiful. Very interesting story. I need to know where this is going. J Novel, if you're ever watching me, which I doubt it, please print the light novel of that. I need it. I need it so bad. And then finally, more uh, a sense of a bookworm. But the beginning of the manga series of part two. It's looking good. I'm enjoying it. Need to go back to the novels. Because I'm so bad at that. Talking about novels. Which will go right here. Because why not. Let's start with. A Tale of the Secret Saint. We finally got the light novel version. I enjoyed the manga. I hope I enjoy this just as much. But I haven't started reading it yet. So that's on me. But then again I'm trying to finish the mangas first. And then go into light novels. Because I also got. My Happy Marriage, scrawny ass bitch compared to everyone else. Uh, then we've got, ah, I mentioned Full Metal Alchemist earlier. This is where I mentioned them again. We've got The Land of the Sand novel. Look at that, pretty. And of course, The Adopted Alchemist. Now, the reason why I haven't read these is because I'm hoping to finish the mangas first, like reading them and then move on to the novels because I'm not sure if they overlap in any way and or they continue off at the ending I don't know maybe it's in between stuff but I thought if I finish the makeup first then I can't spoil anything for me anyway next we have an upside down book The White Cat's Revenge Volume 2 I'm finally progressing into unknown territory there I'm really excited for that because that's where the manga ended, was volume 1, and now we've got volume 2 of the light novel, and it's like, ee, 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 can't wait. And our final one is, of course, The Saint's Magic Power is Omnipotent, volume 5, and I can't wait for the Ninjoid of Say to come in. I learned from Kino, as usual, because I missed out the pre-order period for that. But anyway, that is all our mangas. Uh, yeah, i got more work coming up, and then more taste, so more baking. And then eventually, who knows, we shall find out in the future, but for now, read and collect all the things, yay!